the barrel of meal wasted not, neither did the cruse of oil fail, according to the word of the Lord, which he spake by Elijah. 1 Kings 17 16 See the faithfulness of divine love. You observe that this woman had daily necessities. She had herself and her son to feed in a time of famine, and now, in addition, the prophet Elijah was to be fed too. But though the need was threefold, yet the supply of meal wasted not, for she had a constant supply. Each day she made calls upon the barrel, but yet each day it remained the same. You, dear reader, have daily necessities, and because they come so frequently, you are apt to fear that the barrel of meal will one day be empty, and the cruise of oil will fail you. Rest assured that, according to the word of God, this shall not be the case. Each day, though it bring its trouble, shall bring its help, and though you should live to outnumber the years of Methuselah, and though your needs should be as many as the sands of the seashore, yet shall God's grace and mercy last through all your necessities, and you shall never know a real lack. For three long years, in this widow's days, the heavens never saw a cloud, and the stars never wept a holy tear of dew upon the wicked earth famine and desolation and death, made the land a howling wilderness, but this woman never was hungry, but always joyful in abundance. So shall it be with you. You shall see the sinner's hope perish, for he trusts his native strength, you shall see the proud Pharisee's confidence totter, for he builds his hope upon the sand, you shall see even your own schemes blasted and withered, but you yourself shall find that your place of defense shall be the munition of rocks your bread shall be given you, and your water shall be sure. Better have God for your guardian, than the Bank of England for your possession. You might spend the wealth of the Indies, but the infinite riches of God you can never exhaust.